Hey guys, welcome back to the next video. Today I have a little job that I can bring you along with me. Um, we have an air leak on a deck airline out here. We'll take a look at it in just a second and we need to get it uh, isolated and repaired. And uh, we're gonna go get started, so we'll take a look at it right now. All right, I got my tools here, so let's go on inside and take a look at it. Okay, so here's the leak, guys, right here. There's a soft patch on it, but it's leaking underneath that. And this is, uh, on both sides there's valves where they can hook up to do work on deck with air. So I'm going to start removing these flanges here so we can remove this pipe. And I've already isolated the air, so it should stop in just a minute. Alright, so the bolts are 24 millimeters. I've already scratched off most of the paint. That allow me to get the wrenches on, which I have right here. I'm going to use uh, longer ones to get started for a little bit more torque. And it should come off pretty easy. It's stainless hardware, so I'm going to get started. Now, like I said, the bolts are stainless. So they're coming off relatively easy here, so it shouldn't take too long to get this flange separated. Alright, there we go. We have the first side disconnected. There's the bolts. It came off a little hard because of the paint, but not too bad. So now we're going to go down here and do the second side. Okay, I got the other flange off here. Now I gotta go around to the little U-bolts and get all them. These are 13 millimeter bolts and they're very easy to get off so it shouldn't be too hard. And there's two more U-bolts back here. Then the pipe will be ready to come out. Okay, I got the entire pipe off here. Let's see it. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go down and clean up the bolts because on the other end, the other flange on the other side, I'm gonna put a valve and tighten it down. That way they can still use the air and I can put the air supply back on while I'm repairing this pipe. So we're gonna go down below and clean the bolts up. Okay, so I just dropped the pipe down. Got it right here. You can see how long it is. It's a little tricky to pull out because of these braces right here for the catwalk above. So now I'm going to install a valve here so they can, if they want to use air, it'll have an air connection there. And we'll be back to normal until I get it fixed. So as always, I'm going to use my Never Seize on the bolts. Put the gasket, and I'm going to bolt it right on there. And then at least it'll be usable. I can put the air back on, and then uh, commence the repairs. Okay, so we're all good. I installed a brand new valve here with a new gasket. And if they need to use air, while I'm working on this, they just disconnect here and hook up, and uh, here's the valve. So I can go put the supply back on to this line, and everything's good on deck while I'm repairing. Okay, so I've got the pipe right here, and just behind me over here is a stairway that goes down to the stern. The mooring winches are back there. And I'm gonna take this pipe down there, sit it on the deck, and it's a little bit long for the shop. It would fit in there, but it's a little hard to work. Uh, other people are in there working, maybe. So I'm gonna try to do the repair on the stern, uh, if possible. So I'm gonna go back here, and the part that's uh, patched up, I'm gonna clean it up and see how big the hole is and how much I need to cut out to repair it. So for now, we're just gonna take it back here and secure it for the night. All right, so I'm gonna have to just slide it down the stairway here. And of course, we'll get a measurement on it so that when I cut it, I know the original length of it so that when we put it back in, whatever I do ends up being the same length. All right, there we go. So we're good. And I could just go down below and just pull it out. So it looks like it wasn't too bad. All right, I got the air back on here. And no leaks at all. Everything's perfect. So we're good to work on the pipe. However long it takes. All right, so we're going to go down here and take a look at the pipe. 
This is on the stern, the mooring deck. It's getting a little darker here out in the middle of the Atlantic. It's a nice cool day and it feels really good, not too bad. Okay, so here we go. You can see right here, that's the hole. And this area here is all rusted out. But I did a little tapping around. When it gets back to here, and right here, it's all really good pipe, really thick and strong. So I'm just gonna cut that section out. I got my saw right here. And then I'm gonna try to find another piece of pipe to put over top, and then we'll weld it around. And the same on that end there. And we should be back in business. And I already got my measurement on the total length. So we should be good. Shouldn't be too bad to fix. Okay, so I cut the pipe. Now look, you can see it's a little thinner there on the top. But then the rest of it, it's pretty thick. And that's right where it's bad. You can see it's thinner. So once I cut back, or go back here to weld, it should be plenty fine. So I think we're gonna be okay. And uh, we'll just go try to find a piece of pipe that goes over the top of this. Uh, really snug and then we'll be good. Okay, so I just left the shop, which is right up here in the port tunnel. And I've got the pipe here now. And what I've done is welded this lar little bit larger size pipe over top of. And underneath here was all the where we seen before that was bad. So I welded that over top. So just welded here. And what we're gonna do now is go up and try to reinstall it. All right, so I'm on the port side. I just bled the air pressure out on this valve here, so the line has no pressure. So I go back around the other side now and start connecting the, uh, the pipe. It's a beautiful day out here again. Nice, cool day. Really nice out. All right, so halfway done here. That one's connected. Got my tools here. We're gonna move them down to the other side and uh, continue and then we'll go put the air back on. Okay, so the air is back on. Everything looks okay. So I think we're good. And I don't hear any air anywhere on the flanges that we tightened up. Looks good. So we're gonna call this job all done. Hey everybody, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. That way I know that you like the content. And if you haven't subscribed, consider doing so. Come back and see us uh, with some more videos real soon. And uh, thanks again for watching, and we'll see you guys on the next video.